This is TFNN, the Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. Good morning, everyone. On this Friday, the 8th of uh, September, Tiger Financial News Network, 10 o'clock a.m. Market update, Dow's up 19 at 34,521. Yesterday it had this rotation, this corrective rotation is really interesting because uh, yesterday, the day before, the Dow was much weaker than the other ind indices. Yesterday, the Dow was stronger than the other indices. Today, the Dow is up now 28 at 34,524. And the S&P is having a little chance to lead a little bit here. Look, SPX, there we go. The S&P is up 11 uh, at 4,462. Uh, the nine period moving average is still green. That's important. And look at the QQQ. The nine period moving average is still green and it's up $1.61 at 373.70. <clears throat> Holding quite nicely. It has been a digestive phase the last uh, this past week. Looking at the IWM, the IWM, which was very weak, is weak again today, down 36 underneath the 200 period moving average at 183.97. Now look at this. Here's gold. <clears throat> gold is up 10 at 1952. Yesterday the nine period moving average turned pink. Today let's see if it goes back to green. But gold has been digesting in a sideways fashion as the dollar, let's see if the dollar is pulling back a little bit. Yep, down 17 ticks at 104.88. Uh, so all the technicals are still very strong. And we're going to see the stochastics at 91%. If by Tuesday or Wednesday of next week, the stochastic drops to about 78%. The dollar will finally have a bit of a breather. We're looking also at the crude oil. Hey, crude oil. Crude oil is holding well. It's up 44 cents at 87.27. The combination of higher crude oil, um, higher dollar, and the plummeting, not today, but plummeting TLT. That's the iShares 20-year Treasury bond ETF. Today is up 84 cents at 94.85. That is all putting tremendous pressure on the market. But I see just a little bit of a breather here for today. As I said to subscribers, who can anticipate some kind of a bounce. We're just going to see how it handles any rally that goes maybe down up 60 after 2 o'clock. That'll be important. I'll be back in a moment for the Target Technicians Hour.